Hi everyone, welcome to another Creative Suite online tutorial. In this lesson I'll be teaching you guys how to create a local root folder or local site folder in Dreamweaver Creative Cloud. Um, I know it's a simple thing to do, but for those who don't know how to do it, and most of you guys will most probably already know how to do this, um, for those of you who don't know how to do this, I'll be teaching you guys how to create one in this video tutorial. So let's go ahead and start the tutorial. Let's go ahead and create, uh, open up Dreamweaver Creative Cloud. So the first thing I want to do is go over to my site panel up the top and click on new site. It'll bring up this pop-up window and where it says site name, basically this, t um, it's pretty self-explanatory. It basically tells you what your site name will be. Uh, anyone who views your site will not know this so um, let's give it um, our first site name so I'll, I'll type in first site one but down be uh, beneath this you'll see um, a tab uh, which says local site folder and basically this is where your local root folder will be so when you create your website all your files your images um, your documents, all of that will be in this local root folder. Um, we have it set to the default C users slash Andrew slash document slash unnamed site 2 and I'll save it as that. I'll click save. I'll click OK and basically because that folder doesn't have any files um, it doesn't have any images, doesn't have any, you know, video files, etc. You won't see it in this, in your files, um, panel. But once you start adding files, you'll see it pop up within this files panel over here. And that's basically it. That's how you create a local root folder in Creative Cloud. Um, if you have any questions, please post them in the, uh, comment section below. And uh, please subscribe to my channel. More video tutorials will be coming up. And um, again, thanks for watching. Please subscribe. See ya.